Hi everyone, welcome back to another Cut Above with Chris and I wasn't going to do another shave before the weekend but I decided I'm just going to have another one anyway I'm going out for dinner with the wife and kids tonight so I'm going to use some Shave of Heaven Honey Ale and this is the vegan soap that they discontinued um, I only just actually found out on the Paste and Cut forum I wasn't even aware that Shave of Heaven have um, ceased trading they stopped making the soap, so I was quite surprised because they make cracking soaps, the scents are amazing. So, uh, hopefully, those guys will come back, but we'll just need to wait and see what happens. Sorry about that, guys. Just had the kids running in the bathroom and running all over the place. They're playing sort of hide and seek with some toys. So, um, yeah, so I was quite surprised at the sharp shop. So, I've got three of the soaps, I've actually got four, but one of them's going to be in my giveaway. Um, the spice pumpkin will be in the giveaway, which smells lovely. It just didn't really suit me I wasn't really that keen on it so hopefully someone will enjoy it. Um, the brush I'm using today is some Olgate 30. I haven't bloomed the soap, the soap is quite a soft soap, it's firm but it's soft. So just shake out the excess and straighten the tub. So I'm not going to hang about, the wife's just come home so the quicker I get shaved, the quicker I can get out, the quicker I can get fed, the less grumpy I'll be. But yeah as you can see just a shame that they're, they're no longer making it. It's not that they've went out of business, I, I believe they've just maybe just had enough, but there's a lot of artisans out there, and I can imagine it's quite tough to sort of um, live a life on this sort of thing and actually make enough money to survive. To do it for so long as they did, it's quite impressive, really. I mean, don't get me wrong, I've thought about doing it myself and actually getting into it, because I, I absolutely love soaps and I'm, I do enjoy using essential oils and things like that, trying to create new scents. But I think I'll probably just leave that to the pros. Right, got enough on there, just wet the face. I just had a shower, but a long day at work today, so. Uh, face like that. A little dip in the water. And here we go, first pass. I've got the Shaver Shop razor, brand new Vascot blade in there. Um, and as you know, I've been using this recently and it does a great shave, so hopefully we get the same results. It's only been two days growth, so... It's not something that my skin's used to having shaved this often. Better get used to it. At the moment, I'm really enjoying it. These fast gun blades are absolutely brilliant. No, right, pass one down. Let's see guys, I'll just be flicking through this one as quick as I can, there won't be much talking really. You know me, I like to talk anyway, so I'll just sort of give her as I go. The scent on this is honey eel. Very sweet. It smells so too. You could almost eat it. It smells that good. Definitely get a bit of honey there. 
and it's got a, it has a sort of stouty smell scent to it. That's it's really nice stuff. There we go. Ripe strawberries, sweet apples, grape concord, sparkling citrus, honey, and spice vanilla. Beautiful. Pass number two. I think I'm actually probably close enough now for a pickup. So I'll probably just finish off now with a pickup because I want to get out the door and get some of the tea. You can see that lad, that's just lovely. Old lick and flick. There we go guys, lovely jubbly. All right, I'm just gonna finish off with some Sofilo, Sofilo de la Rosoyo um, after shave cream, which is lovely stuff. Don't need much of it. Absolutely love it, especially on a day like this. Beautiful, beautiful day. Anyway, guys, um, I'm going to leave it at that. It's just been a quick one. I just wanted to throw it out there. Shave of Heaven Honey Oil, lovely stuff. The, all the soaps are great. They lather great. They smell great. They do a great job. Uh, the Samog 830, good old faithful. Never lets me down this brush. Does a great job as well. There's loads of lather in there. It's actually really thick. It weighs a ton. Shaver Shop, Merca 34C knockoff. Great little razor, really is, for 30 bucks. Can't ask for much more. And then I finished off with Sulfilo del Rosario aftershave cream, which is really nice as well. Just sort of finishes the shave off. Gives it a nice, puts a bit of moisture back in. Gives your skin a lovely soft feeling. And I'm not gonna put it on just now, I'm gonna wait to get my shirt on, but I'm gonna pop a little bit of this on, off camera, Lamani. It's just cheap stuff, that really is. Just uh, cheap, but it smells great, and that's sometimes all it's about. As much as I've got no idea what chemicals are in there and what they do to your skin and what they do to your insides, it smells good. Only live once. Anyway, guys, thanks for tuning in. Have a great day, and I'll see you at the weekend. Thank you.